The mansion will not protect you, fiend. Come out and face your crime. We aren't afraid of you any longer. The witch hides. Break down the door. Be cautious, my friends. The Baroness has power within her lair, and she well knows it. We rush in at our peril. And who comes now? More minions of the Baroness? Or yet more helpless souls she has tormented? You are not aware. Clearly you are a stranger here then. I am Justice. I have watched this place and seethed at the wrongs visited on these poor folk. And now I seek to aid them. Once we lived in the real world and the Baroness ruled over us. She took our children and used their blood to work dark and evil magic. And when we burned down her mansion, she cast one final spell that brought our spirits here. We've been trapped ever since, still under her rule. We have to help these people. It must be terrible to be trapped in this grey, lifeless world. I think that since the Baroness trapped these people here, that she's our best chance of getting out. Tell me, stranger, will you help us in this righteous task? The Baroness and her minions are powerful, but you seem an able sort. Your aid would be welcome. From the world of mortals, as are all these people. We lived in a village in the Black Marsh, and the Baroness ruled over us. That was so long ago, it seems like a dream we once had. We finally rose up against her evil, and this is what she did to us. I can't even imagine what happened to our families. Has it been so long? How many years have we been held here? Take heart, good woman. Justice will see you avenged and freed. Will you help us, stranger? If this wrong is to be undone, we will need your aid. She is a creature of pride, that one. She uses others to feed her vanity, just as they feed her power. I will not stand in the way of your folly even so. Still, I hope you will reconsider. Surely doing justice has worth, even in your world. These good people have been held in the thrall of this sorceress for too long. I seek to free them. It's been a nightmare that seemed to go on forever. Until justice arrived, we didn't even know this wasn't real. I can no longer stand by and watch. The sorceress has fled into her lair, but a reckoning is called for. We must act, stranger. You won't help us. Have you no compassion? Do not trouble yourself, good woman. It is pointless to appeal to that which does not exist. I am troubled by your refusal, mortal, but I understand it. We will prevail, even if we must do so on our own. Very well. The mistress says, away! Away with you, you hooligans! How dare you try to assault perfection! Couldn't have said it better myself. We've barricaded the doors and all the windows. Just try to break in. We'll defend the Baroness to the last. You again? What now? Go away. Malcontent. Ingrate, her perfection rules over you people, and this is how you repay her. As you say. You again? What now? Go away. Hmm, I suppose the fact that you are apologizing at all means you are not the same as them. I'll leave it up to the Baroness to decide what's to be done with you then. She'll know. She always knows. Now this is unexpected. I could have sworn I said that I was accepting no visitors, especially from out there. Many apologies, mistress. These strangers have come to speak with you. I thought you... Hmm. From the lands beyond the veil, I see. How interesting. I will grant this audience. Very good, mistress. I will see to the barricades.
Ugh, I don't like her. There's something about her that makes my skin crawl. And I don't think I even have skin in this place. Now then, what brings you into my parlor, hmm? You seek my aid, perhaps? A settlement? There will be no settlement. I refuse to negotiate. Their lives and blood were my due as their rightful ruler. They dared to turn against me. They dared to burn me in my own home. This was their punishment. Their lives are still mine even now. I will never give them up. Perhaps there is. Rid me of the fools outside, especially that loathsome spirit of justice, and I shall return you whence you came. I don't like the sound of that at all. She looks powerful and up to the task of getting us out. I say we go with her. When do we stop talking and start fighting? I'm sick of this hazy dreamland. It is no simple matter to tear the veil, especially when the magic that keeps you here makes it strong. But I am stronger still. Is your service worth more? Perhaps it is, at that. Very well, mortal. Succeed, and there will be blood enough to permit your wildest fantasies. That, and your freedom. Agreed? Excellent. And just in time, it seems. And there she is. Now you answer for your crimes, witch! Indeed. Perhaps you haven't met my new protector. Do say hello. You are not the only one who has sought allies from the mortal world, sorceress. So, the Grey Warden and the First are meeting again. And it has an ally. The mistress that is of this place. It is now a friend. The Grey Warden speaks boldly, for one that has survived its fellows only by chance. So you stand with the Sorceress. It is a sad day when evil finds such ready accomplices. Enough. It is speaking too much to the Grey Warden. The battle, it must be done now. Bothersome. It seems you were as good as your word, mortal. The rebellious rabble have been defeated. Now then, I did agree to a reward, did I not? Do you have a preference? As you wish. And you still need to return to the mortal world, yes? I'll need someone from your world with an actual life force to plunder. And my, my, it seems you're in luck. This one isn't quite dead yet. No, no, I was not to even be in this place. The mother, it is her deceit, her doing. Then we'll know who to thank, won't we? You did this. You sided with that foul sorceress, and now she has sundered the veil. I have been sucked into this world against my will! 
She has returned to this realm as well. Can you not feel it? The Baroness is nearby. So this is the world of mortals. How very dull it seems. Ah, it seems I was not the only one to be drawn here. How very tiresome. <laughs> what need have I for allies now? Yet, should I join with you? You seem uninterested in virtue, but perhaps I am too quick to judge. I would join you, if you will have me. Then I must forge a new path. Until we meet again, Grey Warden, I wish you good fortune. May your campaign see success. <laughs>